Hey folks, this is Mark here with Seacoast Yacht Sales and today we are on a almost Bristol, Bristol 36 foot hunter. This is a 2004 model. Uh, this boat is in fantabulous condition. It's in better condition of a lot of four or five year old boats. Um, this boat has been fully outfitted by the owner with lots of new equipment. Okay, some of the new is including brand new canvas, Dodger Bimmy Top with Macrolon windows, brand new Raymarine electronics, brand new Quantum mainsail, brand new roller furling by Harkin, brand new Quantum asymmetrical spinnaker, water maker, that's right, a water maker by Spectra, 365 watt solar panels, and the list goes on and on. Uh, this boat's been so well equipped, so well outfitted, I'm sure I will forget a lot of it so please after this video make sure you visit our website at www.seacoastyachts.com for full specs and information so let's uh, go ahead and start this walkthrough again very popular model by hunter these are extremely good sailing boats and they give you a tremendous amount of volume down below that that's equal to greater to most 38 footers on the market of this era See the gel coat in this boat's in gorgeous condition and very well taken care of. Nice wide side decks. Nice chain locker up forward, double bow sprit. All lines run aft to the uh, to the cockpit. Running rigging is new. There's the new Dodger with the Macaron windows. Macaron is top of the line windows for Dodgers. It's crystal clear just like looking through glass. Nice large swim step here makes entry and exit from dock side very easy. Outboard engine hoist. Again the solar panels on top of the uh, Benmi top there. Of course, swim step would not be complete without hot and cold pressure shower. Nice large cockpit. Easily sits six for day sailing, eight for cocktails. Of course, the uh, stern bolster seats here, standard on the hunters. Okay, electronics package is a Raymarine. Uh, multifunction display this is the ES 127 top of the line series and this has the uh, chart plotter the 4kw digital radar AIS uh, the autopilot is an ST 4000 that is an original autopilot but it does have a new drive motor and then of course the Raymarine i70s multifunction displays You can see how clear, how clear that Macaron glass is. It's beautiful, and this was an extremely expensive Dodger to have made. So the owner spent the extra money and has a full Dodger cover on it, which means that in six and seven years, when Dodgers are generally left out in the sun, you just replace the cover instead of the whole entire Dodger. Very roomy cockpit. Okay. Let's go ahead and go down. Oh, before I forget, these are the Zarkar companion way doors. Replaces the factory slide ins. Okay. Going down below. First thing you notice is just the amount of natural light and ventilation in this boat. Hunters are well known for this. And again, the interior volume on these 136 equals boats two to three feet larger in her same class. The veneer in this boat's been uh, exceptionally well maintained. I don't see any areas of wood damage, of sun bleaching. Beautiful, the floors are in gorgeous condition. New upholstery. 
So here's the port. Port side set T sleeps one. Starboard side set T sleeps two. The custom table does drop down and, and uh, to convert that into the double. And again, this is a custom, custom table the owner had made. Boat sleeps a total, a total of uh, seven, seven guests. Two in the forward cabin, two in the aft cabin, two in the convertible dinette, and one on the full size set T to port. Okay, nice galley, well designed. Got a two burner propane, a force 10 stove and oven, microwave, double stainless steel sink, refrigerator freezer, lots of cabinet storage in this boat, dish storage. Here is the, uh, the guest cabin here. This is almost a full size queen bed. Above the pillows there is a uh, emergency exit and also ventilation hatch that opens up. Fans throughout this boat, 12 volt fans. Engine access is underneath these stairs and I will get to that in a second. All right, the head is found on the port side. Very roomy for a boat of this size. You have a separate stall shower here. Again, in a 36 foot boat, to find a separate stall shower is very rare. Just want to take a, a quick pick here. The dreaded bilge area. So these are your main uh, seacocks, your main through haul valves. Again, very clean, very organized, very well kept. forward full navigation station new ray marine vhf radio with ram mic for the cockpit magnum pure sine wave inverter charger spectra ventura 2000 water maker the standard hunter marine uh, tank monitoring system fusion stereo Control panels and this boat also was equipped from the factory with reverse cycle air and heat. Again, lots of natural light and ventilation. You have the big overhead opening port here, two skylights here. Moving forward is the very large V berth. And this is a nice feature here is where this opens up, allows for more ventilation if need be. But again, dockside, the boat does have reverse cycle air and heat. All right, folks, I'll end this uh, walkthrough video here with the engine. Engine access is very easy. Slide this back. And there's your, your Yamar engine, and it gleams. Again, less than 500 hours as of to date. Uh, this is May 2018, and the engine has 465 hours. Very well maintained. All right, folks, thanks for taking the time. And again, if you would like more information on this boat or any boats that Seacoast offers, um, please visit our website at seacoastyachts.com. Again, we are the hunter dealer for Southern California. Um, this is a gorgeous boat. Uh, please feel free to reach out to me. Again, my name is Mark Davenport, 310-804-7535, or Mark, Mark with a K, mark at seacoastyachts.com is my email address. Thank you so much and hope to show you this boat soon. Have a great day.